house for your job over this. Get out of my sight. No, don't be silly. Was Australia wonderful? It was unbelievable. In fact, we documented every moment for you guys. Oh my God! <laughs> Honey, you look. No, actually, we're not. Jack got a little carried away. <laughs> Although I have to admit, I never turned down a photo opportunity. Oh well, I want to know everything. So tell me, was the outback wild and woolly? Not as wild and woolly as our own outback. Huh? Well, there's no place like home, right? Yeah. Maybe, maybe not. What does that mean? Oh, honey, I wish we weren't due back at the main house. I really, you know, would like to catch up on so much. Is there any way we can get out of it? Mm, no. Uh, come on, I really need some Lois Brenda time. Well, let's go inside and take yeah. some Lois Brenda time. You guys can take <gasps> care of yourselves for five minutes, yeah, right? Yeah, okay. All right. Well, can Ellie try? So, did you do any business down there in Australia? Not a lot. Played most of the time. Yeah. I'll judge you from these pictures. Looks like Brenda had a ball. <laughs> Thanks for noticing. <laughs> I have the most exciting news, okay? And I was going to call you in Australia, but then I thought, mm, nah, I'll just wait until I saw you in person. Your mother-in-law's lady. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No. Ned and I are moving to Los Angeles. California? Precisely. But nobody knows but you and my mom, okay? So don't tell Jax. At least not until the cues know, because we don't want Lila finding out until we get a chance to tell her ourselves. You keep the secret, right? Of course. Okay. I know. I know. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, who's going to run L&B, right? No, I was thinking about how much I'm going to miss you. But yes, of course, now that you mention it. I mean, how are we going to be partners when we're living on different coasts? Oh, what do you mean? We did it when you were in Australia. For a week. Oh, sh a week, Shmi, come on. As long as we've got faxes and modems and pagers, are you kidding me? It's like we're practically in the same room. So why do I feel like I'm never going to see you again right now? Because not being in the same room with each other is incomprehensible to both of us. I'm gonna miss you so much. Oh. And then. Yeah. Well, mm. come on. It's not gonna be that bad. Jack, what? He, he flies to Europe for dinner, right? I mean, LA is not that much of a big deal besides you. I already have your own Malibu beach house. That's right, I do. Yeah. It's hard to keep up, huh? Yeah. I really need you to be happy for the rest. I am. I'm happy for you guys. Really? You know, we really need to be someplace where Ned can be Eddie Main without his grandfather grunting disapproval and where I can raise Brooke without the family telling me that I'm doing it wrong all the time. I, I understand. I do. I just want you to be able to, I don't know, maybe keep email yourself into town once a week for lunch or something. He got jumped, didn't he? Okay, uh, was there somebody else with him? Okay, here's what I, here's what I, what I need you to do. Find him. His name is Jason Morgan. He works for me. I want everybody looking into every precinct, every emergency room in the city. And put the word out that everybody's also looking for a girl. She's about five feet tall, long, dark hair, 18, pretty. Her name is Robin Scorpio. No, no, yeah, yeah, I'm on my way. Sonny. Yeah. What's going on with Robin? I don't know. Uh, her and Jason disappeared. But don't worry, I'm, I'm gonna go find him. Uh, Listen, um, if I write down my cell phone number for you, will you call me as soon as you find out that she's okay? Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. What's going on? Robin's missing. Gotta go. See you later.
know Sonny will find it. 